Hey everybody, welcome to the Lunar Lowdown with me, Sally Nerney. This is the lowdown for the full moon of July 4th, where we have the sun in the mid degrees of Gemini and the moon directly across the way in the middle degrees of Sagittarius. Neither of the luminaries are on their own. The sun is conjunct Mercury, still retrograde until the 12th, and the moon very close to that ongoing conjunction of Jupiter and Pluto. And Saturn's not far away either. So much is going on, my friends. But immediately with this full moon, the star beings reminded me that it's the Milky Way that spans this opposition from Gemini to Sagittarius. Literally in the sky from the constellation of the twins across the heavens over to Sagittarius, we find this carpet of stars, this, this complexity of light beings, galaxies, and stellar consciousness. This pathway of light is in partnership with the twins and the archer. It is a partnership of distillation as the twins generate and brainstorm, overwhelming us in possibilities, mental chatter, indecision, confusion, ideas. The centaur can stand upon as a base and a foundation and distill all of this juicy data into a long range vision, long range dreams. Despite the multiple paths before us, the ever changing options and the endless unknowns, where are you going? Sagittarius seeks the vision, the dream, our better future. Sagittarius seeks expansion and growth and prods us out of our ruts and our patterns. While this may be disruptive and uncomfortable, it is in preparation for a new plan and new patterns of being. Saturn and Pluto and Jupiter are all retrograde till later in the year. Believe it or not, this is a time to catch your breath. Would you like more guidance? Join me, Moon Medicine, this week and next. Information on my website. Click on Virtual Gatherings or send me an email. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.